You already know Kowloon Restaurant, established in 1950 and spanning four generations, serves a multi-Asian menu. Did you also know that Kowloon Restaurant is New England's premier Asian dining and entertainment complex, serving Cantonese, Sichuan, Thai, and Polynesian cuisine? And did you know that Kowloon Restaurant is also the home of the finest Japanese sushi? If you haven't dined at Kowloon Restaurant lately, then you simply haven't dined at Kowloon. Kowloon Restaurant, Route 1 North in Saugus. This is Shelton R Benjamin. This is Harley Race. This is Mick Foley. This is Mr. Wonderful Paul Lorndorf. This is the Monster Abyss. This is Daniel Bryan. This is JBL, and you're watching the MWF. Be there live. The MWF Heavyweight Championship match coming up now, Dylan Cage against Vince Vaccaro. Jackal, sudden impact, Dylan Cage will be defending the Heavyweight Championship here tonight, sanctioned not only by the Millennium Wrestling Federation, but by the American Wrestling Association of New England, sanctioned by Commissioner Von Johnson, Lieutenant Commissioner Sonny E, along with Franklin D. Churchill and the MWF Board of Directors. We are now part of the AWA, Jackal. American Wrestling Association, I am shocked. They've been around for a long time. Think of the hungry young athletes from all over the world that we'll be seeing here in the MWF. They have affiliates in Japan, in Canada, California, the Carolinas, all over the Midwest. Our talent will be traveling. We'll be seeing new faces here. Commissioner Von Johnson would not let me tell people last month. Tonight, though, it is official. We're going to be traveling, too? You might. I don't know about me. Oh, you don't know about yourself? So you always send me away. You and the commissioner can split a room. I don't know. He, he, he's always busy. Talia can bounce from bed to bed. But nonetheless, oh. look at Dylan Cage work over Vince Vaccaro. Think back, Jacqueline. It's Soul Survivor 2003. Dylan Cage defeated Vince Vaccaro in the opening of the Soul Survivor competition to crown the first ever MWF champion. Yeah, very true. Vaccaro is known all over New England. Oh, yeah, he's no slouch. Nice takedown. He defeated the veteran Big Polly Gilmore in the opening round of the MWF TV title tournament. However, he was defeated by Die Hard Eddie Edwards in the semifinals. Yeah, that's very true. And we all saw what happened last month on Ultra when Die Hard Eddie Edwards became the first MWF TV champion. In a sensational match. Do you think he's going to steal any of Dylan Cage's thunder now that he has gold around his waist? I'm not really sure, but who knows? Get a title for title match. Get it going. That'd be a big matchup. The American Wrestling Association, the real AWA, will be sanctioning all MWF television title matches as well. Now anything is possible. Anything can happen in the MWF. Who would have ever thought, Jack? It's been many years since we've seen the AWA. The AWA is back where it began in the Boston area. Their, their list of world champions, my goodness. What did you think of that montage video? A lot, of, a lot of, I remember a lot of that. What a production team we have here in the MWF to be able to put that together on such short notice. Short notice, my goodness, they had what, a few minutes? Well, I let them know about an hour before we started this broadcast. That, that, that's tough. Yeah, you're talking 60 minutes to do all that. When you're the Millennium Wrestling Federation... And when you are the New England affiliate of the American Wrestling Association, you get things done, Jackal. I'm, I'm still kind of in shock about this announcement. I understand Commissioner Von Johnson is eagerly trying to make it back from Cape Cod, where he was with Kyle earlier on, to speak about this. Hopefully by the end of the hour, we'll hear from the Commissioner. Oh, hopefully. I think, I, I, I'm sure. I know the Commissioner very well. He'll make it back. No one drives like Commissioner Von Johnson. Oh! No one. Oh, they be changing the name of the uh, the titles here? Or? No, from what I am told, it's going to be the Millennium Wrestling Federation Heavyweight Championship sanctioned by the American Wrestling Association of New England. In other words, we're, we're, it's still going to be Millennium Wrestling Federation, but under the American Wrestling Association banner. Absolutely. All right. I got that straightened out. The fans have known the MWF. They've followed the MWF. The MWF is the brand name. We are just now in affiliation and association with the American Wrestling Association. Uh, I'm, still, you know, I'm still shocked. 
Unbelievable. And Major news. Blockbuster. Oh. I heard CNN picked it up. We have a title match going on right now. Sanctioned by the American Wrestling That's right. Association. They wasted no time getting in on the action, huh? That drop kick from Dylan Cage. Face first, and they've got a face, face full of uh, buckle there. Surprisingly, the trifecta members Jimmy Jack Cash and Hoochie player Danny Jackson are not with him tonight. Do you think he's underestimating Vince Vaccaro? Possibly. I don't know. I'm surprised, too. I thought they always traveled together. Travel on a path. I missed. Went for a spin I kick. Duck that. The Cavour kick, that's Dylan Cage's finisher. I know. It's a little egotistical of good times, Vince Vigallo. Another face first of Buckles. Oh! Oh! Oh, wait a minute! He knows! Oh, bad one, two, three! That's Unbelievable! Dylan Cage retains the oh. MWF Heavyweight Championship. Jackal, what a night we've had here on Ultra, but it isn't over yet. We'll be right back.